Hi, Jeremy Yuker here at Rich and Sons RV Sales here in Grand Island, Nebraska. Wanted to show you guys the new Passport Rove, uh, brand new for 2018. I want to start up here at the front. Here is a large storage compartment held up by a magnet. If you look in here, you'll see it goes all the way across. Um, we've got lights in here, so you'll be able to see what you can, uh, all the things you're going to be putting in there. Aluminum frame, this is a good place where you can see the aluminum framing that helps save a lot of weight on this. Um, while we're down here, show you the stabilizer jacks, one on each of the four corners. Help this thing for be rocking and rolling when you're parked at the campsite and walking around in there. Little electrical outlet out here if you have the margarita machine that you're going to be setting up out here, you can have a place to plug that in. These are brackets for this big Thule awning. Um, nice awning on this uh, here, it's a manual awning, you just crank it out, crank it in and the stabilizer arms can actually attach to here. Right here we have the black tank flush, so anything that goes down in the toilet you'll be able to hook a hose to there, spray that in there and rinse it out. Um, single axle trailer, these are uh, the larger tires, larger axles on this because it's just the single axle. Notice you have the, the uh, fender well here, seven foot wide. That's another way they save a lot of weight in here. You won't be able to tell on the inside that it's only seven foot wide. Um, single step entry, we're not going to go in just yet. I want to show you a few more things on the outside. Nice large assist handle here. Another little cubby hole, um, lots of storage there. There is a hookup for your grill, little gas hookup out here. So if you have a, any kind of grill you want to do out here, you can hook that up and set it around. So back here we have the one inch receiver designed for a bicycle rack. You can put two or three bicycles back here, it's designed for that. Notice you'll see the LED light tail lights too, kind of makes it a little more visible when you're traveling down the road. Just the exhaust for the furnace here. Um, make sure to ask somebody in parts about putting a bug screen over there so the wasps don't make nests in there. This is the outside shower on here, hot and cold running water for rinsing off uh, while you're outdoors. Um, 30 amp service, detachable power cord, and you even have a little hookup down here for cable. This is the Schwintec gear driven slide you can see here. Seals great, one of the best sealing slides out there. Um, and easy to operate, just push a button on the inside. Uh, water fill here, this is if you're just going to fill the tank. And this one here is if you're going to run off of a city hose hookup or something like that. You can hook right up there. You have the uh, six gallon gas electric hot water heater. Pretty self explanatory on that. And then the other side of that pass through storage. Um, and still another magnetic door. Yeah, down here we actually have a uh, solar port so you can charge the batteries off of a solar panel. Uh, this will come with a single battery but it is uh, prepped so you can put a second battery on there. Two batteries, you have the single propane tank, that's the smaller one that you can exchange at your local hardware store or gas station. And I know it's a little guy, lightweight, but it even comes with the power tongue jack to make that easier on you. Welcome to the inside of the little roof. Uh, first thing you'll notice here is you've got a complete countertop here, glass top, two burner stove. Put that down, gives you a little more counter space. Plug-ins on both sides in case you wanted to bring that uh, margarita maker from outside inside uh, later. Single sink, stainless steel. Nice little uh, refrigerator here, and we've got plenty of room for all the beverages you might take along. There's even a little freezer um, if you wanted food, too. Convection microwave oven, which is a great idea. Um, you, you have storage over here, and then the oven is here, and that's a half-time oven. So that'll actually cook all of your oven recipes in half of the time that it takes you to cook them in a conventional oven. While we're pointed back this way, we'll show you all the storage you get in here. This is a little camper, but it's got the nice features like the metal ball bearing, slide out drawer guides, three drawers, lots of storage underneath the stove, a little bit of storage underneath the sink, even has a furnace if you want to use it on a cool day. Air conditioning up top, that'll be a 13,500 BTU air conditioner. Keep it plenty cool on here in the warm days. Um, dinette booth full wrap around. You've got the table you can move. You can take that inside or outside. Use it anywhere you'd like. Um, queen bed here. This is pushed up there so a little bit of a cuddling bed but people don't tend to mind. 
flat screen TV comes with this and you have your Furion stereo system. Additional storage back here as far as a wardrobe goes. A couple of drawers there too. They even included a bathroom in this little guy. You've got of course the toilet there, a little hand sink, um, and it's an all-in-one capsule bathroom. Includes the shower, lights in there, there's a fan to uh, blow out any uh, steam that may be created from taking a shower. One piece surround. Nice little bathroom in this guy actually. And that's the uh, all new Rove uh, Passport. Comes in under 3,100 pounds, right at 20 foot long. Easy to pull with any of your small sport utilities, possibly even a minivan. Uh, stop down and see us at Rich and Sons or visit us on our website, richsonsrv.com.